Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Anushka. So today we are gonna be doing a get ready with me. I'm going out for my mum's birthday. We're just gonna treat us to like some good food and stuff. This top is so cute. I got it from H&M, although I got an extra small. It's really tight, but I feel like it's okay. It's cute. But it's so nice. I feel like polka dots are so in. I've got these like really like frilled out sleeves and it's like really thick as well. So I'm definitely not cold in it. I wouldn't wear this in summer. I'd be really hot in it. Anyways, before we jump into the video i'm gonna do my post notification shout out and today's one's gonna go to makeup by Cristel. so thank you so much for your sweet comment if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button and let me know in the comments below when you've done so or you can just leave a nice comment headband is from new look i actually really like it. it's really cute i don't really wear headbands but i thought you know let me make an effort today right so my face is dry as hell i'm first going to start off with some new red eye cream which has also spf in there then I'm going to take some of my Tony Moly Mini Peach Lip Balm. I bought this on Beauty Bay. And it just literally smells like pure peach. Really hydrating. And packaging is so cute. Right, then we need moisturiser. I'm going to go in with my Embryolise um, Moisturiser Delay Creme Concentrate. It's actually really, really nice. Can you believe I was curling my hair and I literally burnt my leg like I leaned down to get the clip that fell off my leg and without knowing I pressed the iron thing on my leg and it, like literally cooked my thigh. I feel like I could feed it to someone. It's so painful. That's why you should be so careful with these tools. You don't know how many times I've burnt myself. I'm going to go in with this Bioderma Pigment Bio SPF 50. I've been loving this stuff and it's really hydrating. I don't think um, it's out yet. I think it comes out in April, um, but I'll keep you guys updated. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, guys, because that's where I'm always at when I'm not on YouTube. And I do so many giveaways on there. It's just easier. I've been trying out the Anastasia Luminous Foundation, which to be honest, I've really been enjoying. Again, I'm so shocked I got the right shade, but I'm in the shade 345C. I've been using this for like the past week now, and I really do like how hydrating it is. I'm gonna use my favorite sponge at the moment. It's the EX1 Cosmetics one. It's so bomb. Now, this does give me smile line, so I don't put too much around my mouth, like on my smile line area. I just put some on my neck and my chest area. Going really natural today, guys. I'm not going to do much. Because that's just how I am on a daily. I don't know what concealer. I think I'm just going to go with my trusty old Tarte Shape Tape, as always. This is my Tarte Shape Tape in Tan San. I love this stuff. I always have a backup. And I don't put even that much, to be honest. Got some scarring there. Lately, I'm not gonna lie, it's been kind of um, hard to get motivated to film. I don't know why. So last weekend, I barely did anything, but I was like lucky that I had some like pre-filmed content. But like, sometimes I'm just like, oh, I, I, I don't wanna film. And that's like the downside to this. It won't seem like authentic or real when I do that because you will tell. And I've done it before in some other videos and you can tell like I'm a bit down and I hate that when I look back at it, it makes me cringe. This is actually what helps me a lot. I look back at all my old videos, like my creative ones, and it really gets me going. Um, so that's what I did yesterday. And today I woke up like motivated to, you know, set everything up. I think it's the setting up that annoys me. I feel like... Once I have a room or a dedicated space where everything's set up and I can just leave it and go and come back and just turn the camera on, I'll be a bit better when it comes to, you know, being more motivated. But once, like, all this comes back down and away and it's just such a pain. But, you know, it just has to be done. That's, that's what it is. It's work, you know? Guys, I love this base. Gosh, I feel like that my hairspray is going into my mouth. I'm not gonna lie to you, I've been loving the Huda Beauty Tantoin Medium. Um, it's quite dark, but it blends so easily. I've been using it every day. So I use a, my Real Techniques stippling brush. buff it into my um, 
hairline just like the perimeter of my face you can always go in with your sponge to soften it out and i go in with a bit of my laura mercier powder This is one of my favourite blushes ever, it's the Just Peachy Blush by LA Girl and honestly I wear it all the time but I can't like even get a dent in it. Then I'm going to go in with my Honest Beauty Balm. I literally just like blend this on my cheeks. I just love this like glowy look from within. For my brows, I'm going to use my Brow Sculpting Pencil by Hourglass. This is in the shade Ash and I actually really like this shade because it really shows my um, natural hairs and it doesn't look too harsh. I'm gonna use my Benefit 24 hour brow setter. I love this. I literally can't live without this brow gel. Brow has in place. I'm gonna pop some of this all night setting sprays just so that, you know, my makeup stays in place. And this stuff is really, really nice. I don't really like the smell though. Now for my eye today, I'm just gonna take my Huda Beauty Nude Medium Palette and I'm just gonna grab one of the brown shades in here and just like blend that into my crease. Putting it on my crease and on my lower lash line and just like slightly wing it out. Gosh, this foundation is so nice. Next, I'm gonna use the Benefit Roller Liner in the shade Brown really love this um liner i haven't used it in ages though looked my eye myself in the eye and now it's watering so the next, we're just going to put a bunch of mascara on. Where on earth is my lash carrier? You want that lift. I'm going to go with my favourite at the moment, which is the Fenty Beauty Full Frontal Mascara. Then for lips, I'm going to go in with this Hourglass um, Lip Gloss. This is in the shade Truth. Alright guys, this is the final look. I'm going to head out now. I hope you guys enjoyed this little get ready with me. And if you guys want to see more, let me know in the comments below. I'm actually feeling this headband now. Although I hope it doesn't give me a headache throughout the day. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And follow me on Instagram because that's where you can find me when I'm not on YouTube. And yeah, I'm going to eat tons of food today and then eat properly from tomorrow, which is Monday. Okay um so yeah i'll see you guys in my next one